What's going on, everybody, and welcome back to another episode. Wait a minute, I just realized we're missing food from here, so I guess we got all the food that there was, because all there is, some meds, huge amount of weapons, lots of parts. We need the parts more than anything. Um, so welcome back to another episode of This War is Mine, the uh, Stories DLC. We are going to try to go back into here again. I'm going to bring a weapon with me. And that's it. We need 17 more of these in order to upgrade to make a saw. Um, so we're gonna... Wait, why the hell couldn't I... There I go. So we're gonna scavenge. I hope this doesn't end badly. I'm not sure exactly what's gonna happen, but uh, if we do die, I think I know what I'm gonna end up having to do. And that is... Uh, restart and the first thing we're going to be looking at doing is upgrading see so there won't be anything in there that's going to be a rat this dude where is he yeah, he's in the building somewhere oh we can hide in here Supply crates bear military markings that look like they were brought here recently. Right? I'm screwed. Yeah, you are. Okay, maybe. If he goes up here, I'm going to try to go out here and search these things. Even here. Oh, nice, he's dead. Yes. Okay, let's pick his pockets. Dude, I honestly didn't, I forgot you could do the sneak attack and I think that was our saving grace because it took out like half of his health. Grab it all, we got guns, baby. Okay, let's check out this stuff here. He's the only one that's here, so. Drag marks quite deep. They lead straight to the road by the gas station. The truck should be a bit further ahead. Yeah, it will be. Okay, and here's the truck. So we can get the information. It must have hit something. It's full of crates, judging by the markings that contain military food, rations, and medical supplies. Okay, hopefully we can get lots of food. No. We got one piece of freaking food. Okay, we can go in there. This sucks. And we got wood. We're not going to get the pieces we need, I don't think. Oh, boy. Uh. Get rid of those. Get that. That's going to help us to make things. We only got one freaking piece. Are you kidding me? I'll go back and check this one. I can't remember what the hell was in here. And I don't think we can go down here. I still think there's a doorway there, but... Nope. Because that's going to be a blocked off door, I think. Or... Is it not? Wait, let's check this first. 
A lot of lies on the ground to your brother. I gathered some fuel for the winter. It seems that I won't need it after all, so I hope that you'll find it useful until Amelia, when her uncle loves her, farewell. Okay, please be goodies. Four, eight, nine, ten. Damn it! Uh, well, we can take, excuse me, take those. Um, we don't need these. Okay, we got those. Damn, four, eight, ten. We're short three. What's in here? Damn it! Okay, well, we're gonna come back here another night because we gotta get rid of the. We got to get the other stuff. We'll find out what's in here. We'll also take a look at that and see. I think we're pretty much done here. Yeah, this was... Yeah, there's nothing else here. And this was just the other crap, I believe. Yeah. So we got a few other things that we can get. But uh, homegrown tobacco, roll-up cigarette. Yeah, none of that's worthwhile taken right now and you know what I want to go up here because I can't remember if we got everything at the top can I get up here nowhere else to go all right so I guess that's that for this there you go this truck full of supplies we just what we need Malik broadcasts location he'll help many people survive and I think what happened I'll show you guys what I did uh, off camera I was doing some of the mining but I thought I'd bring you back for going to the gas station I didn't think we were going to attack this guy but um, what I did is on the radio it is getting very cold which is why I got the books um, on the radio one of the things that we could do is we could broadcast uh, full supplies of Grunach. I guess I should read this to Malik. Good. Uh, Malik, go make your announcement. Uh, she's sad and very tired, so let her go up there. She can go sleepy sleep. And then I'll get her to cook some food. He can eat those two, she can eat one. That should make us all very happy. Um, I still gotta make a saw. So, uh, the broadcast that we put out was the basement of the gas station on Maple Street holds plenty of fuel for the stoves. I think people went and broke in that gate, and that's why we didn't need the saw for it. So, that's most likely how that happened. And then we have good news. An army truck filled with military rations and medical supplies has broken down at a gas station on Maple Street. Get your share before the military reclaims it. Alright. So, that's going to be that right there. This young man... Uh, we're not chopping that down. You can't do anything for me. Um, yeah. What's your bio say? We're all in this together. We must aid each other however we can. Uh, morning radio. Oh, yeah. Day 10. and I don't think there's anything he can do. I'm not sure if I can make pieces here. No. Thermoregulator. I have no idea how to even get that. Uh, but we have stuff that we can make. I guess you're just going to have to listen. In her bio, she has, I hope people manage to take the supplies from the truck before the army gets there, and that no one will get hurt. Alright, cool. So with her, once she's uh, back on track, uh, yeah, see, there's nothing we could do. 
that can get us anything, I don't think, anyways. Um, so I'm gonna, I'll wait for her to wake up, and then I'm gonna feed him, and I'll bring you guys back. I want to cut these episodes a little bit, just, uh, now, especially since we're getting to the part where, uh, things are gonna be done fewer and farther between, like, there's just gonna be me sitting, staring at a screen until this says she's not tired anymore, so, if anything happens, I am recording, I'll be sure to include it in the episode, but for right now, I'm gonna cut, I'll see you guys in a second once we get the whole thing, uh, reorganized, and hopefully we're through this, we're halfway there. I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, everybody, we are back. Uh, we have a few different things here now. We have a warehouse, which has lots of food. Um, uh, it used to be a warehouse of a big store. Currently, it's used as a hideout by a group of armed thugs. We might find useful things there if we can sneak in, but it's very dangerous. Huge amount of materials, lots of meds, huge amount of weapon parts, and it's filled with danger. Uh, we have the city center. It used to be beautiful with parks, squares, and monuments. are all surrounded by old buildings. The war has taken its toll on the area. Some food, huge amount of, excuse me, of materials, lots of weapons, and some parts. Uh, the thing I want to do, I want to actually go back to the gas station. Oh, shit. We don't have a pry bar. Okay. Then I guess we're not. We're going to Central Square. Um... I want to grab some more parts if I can. I got to be able to get to, um, I think, making a saw, upgrading the garden. I think I got to do that first. I think that has to be first and foremost. Um, we have our... We'll take the knife. Yeah, we'll just do that. Then we'll head in there. We'll see if we can do anything in here without getting killed. And, um, mostly, trades go on even during the war. Wow. A big area. Okay, good. We got the stuff we need. So we're, we're officially golden. If we, um, get shot at or anything, we just gotta run to the exit. Fresh blood on the ground. Something bad happened here recently. Oh, shoot. Something going on down here, too. Lots of footprints from heavy soldiers. Certainly not the best idea to hang around here. Soldiers must be close. Oh, they're right there. Holy hell. Okay. We're gonna need a saw, I bet ya. Is there anything over here? No. So what is going on out here? Is there anything going on over here? Not that I can see. Okay, and we got a broken down area there. Try this here. How much longer do we have to wait for these bloody intelligence guys? Okay. See if we have anybody else inside. Sorry, I'm just adjusting my mic. Sounds like someone's in here. Prisoners. If the guards see me uh, for the time, they'll spill ever. Oh. So if the guards see you, when are the intelligence guys coming? And we could go up here. There's that guy. And what's over here? Once the interrogation team is here, these punks will confess everything or die. 
I don't know if there's anything here, if that's a rat. Nope, there's definitely someone there. I know. If he didn't talk in his sleep, I'd have took him for dead. Okay. So this is a brutal place. Held in prison that signed to Bagel. Okay, I think it's time we got the hell out of here. And then we'll shut the door. There. Okay, let's get out of here. I think we have enough stuff that we could upgrade the garden or the uh, thing and make a saw. Which I think that'll help us with the ghost house. You knew this wasn't going to be that easy. So at least now we know there's uh, bad news bears out here. Yeah, that dude's right there. I mean, if we took him... We took him on alone, we could probably get away with it. I think it's time we left. I mean, we made a pretty good uh, haul. Discovered that the army is torturing some people suspected on helping the rebels. They'll most likely be killed if they're not rescued soon. So this might actually end up helping us because what I've noticed is, like I said, the last one, we had all that fuel in the basement in the gas station and everybody ended up, um, I guess, going there and breaking the lock. So kind of worked out in our advantage. Uh, the one, one problem I see, we must act quickly. We have to help those people. The night was calm. I learned that the army's holding some people at Central Square. Okay, she's tired, so she's got to go, uh, you know what, up here. Him, he needs to do his little message things. He's still hungry. He's sick now. So we have medications. We have two, actually, which is good. I want her to go up there. Uh, her, actually, she can go here. And then we can make some wood. Okay, the army's holding brutally torturing innocent people in the building at Central Square. If anyone who hears this is able to save them, please hurry. There's no time to lose. Alright, so maybe, just maybe, that'll take care of some people there. We'll get her to collect this crap here. Uh, grab all those. Exit. And that should help us with this. Get her to do this as well. Okay, what do we got? More wood, I assume. Good. Okay, so we have that. This guy here, you listen. Her, we need you to take a nap. Uh, we didn't get any food there either. We got news. Okay, once she's not tired... I'm going to send her over. Let's hope the rebels have heard our broadcast and free those poor people. How can the government forces torture their own citizens? The military is getting even more brutal towards civilians. I'd wager none of the people detained in Central Square actually has anything to do with the rebels. Alright. Oh, God damn, we got snow in here. I wonder if we could use that for... Uh, Someone's at the door. Okay, you know what? I know you're tired, but... You gotta go. You're the only one who can actually go up and down the stairs. So hurry, hurry, hurry. Hopefully they got food. And I got all those premium cigarettes, too. Come on in. Come on, I haven't got all day. Shut your pie hole, fool. Alright. Taking that. And I'm taking that. Uh, what else? What is this? Mixer. We need that. Okay. Okay. Wow. Are you kidding me, dude? Nothing special, but not bad either. Oh, 
Oh, oh. Okay, we gotta make a pry bar too. We have 40 of these now. Badass. Yeah, I think that's good. Can I squeeze? Uh... Damn. We need that mixer. I can't remember what for, but it was for something. Uh... Yeah. Okay. What the hell is this? Oh, it's the pitcher again, isn't it? A long missing letter thrown through the window. A soldier was killed because of your radio broadcast. The military is sniffing around. Take care. I knew this day would come. It's getting really scary. Yeah, it's because I, <laughs> I killed the dude. Alright, let's go... Let's go up here. We'll make some food. Uh, no, this. And then we're officially out of water, too. What does this say? A horrible letter. Nobody has ever threatened to kill my uncle before. What should I do? Kill him yourself before they get to him? Okay. Uh... I need you to come up here. Okay, give him that. You're sick. You need medicine. Take this. Okay. Oh, and let's talk. We're helping people, but I don't know how much longer we can keep doing it. The army won't sit on their hands listening to our broadcasts. That's true, but this is the price of changing the situation in our city. It's worth it, my love. Alright. So she can go sleep. He's sick, but on meds. What else was I looking at? I don't know if this guy can put another one in here or not, but... And then I want to see what he can do with this. Because there's nothing else he can do out here. He can't go downstairs. And I gotta get her back on this. And then this. I know we need the uh, little bar. I don't know if we can make it in here. But we'll see. No. Okay. And with this one here. One of these takes a med thing, and the other one as well. Or It's dangerous outside. Yeah, we just leave them there. <laughs> this is the one. So it enables me to manufacture real meds and quality roll-up cigarettes. Okay. We have the stuff to make it, but I sure as hell ain't doing that. So let's go... Well, I wonder what the snow is. Okay, her. Get over here and do this. And I'm calling the episode here. I didn't realize we're running a little long. So thank you everybody for watching. And I will see you in the next one. Take care.